can do this with any bed you have. All beds are going to be different, so I'm going to walk you through. I, I picked up a, a second-hand bed on Craigslist just to show Ada how to do it. Right. Um, okay. and, and as we go through this, Ada, um, I'll give you some tips to use for your specific bed, and for viewers at home, I'll tell you some, some ins and outs. And um, okay. I started this morning. Yeah, you Take constructed the majority of the bed this morning yeah. using another bed. So there's our classic bed, headboard, footboard, oh, yeah. and two side rails. So what I did was I took off the two side rails and they've got little metal brackets. So just remove any hardware. Um, some beds, will, you, you know, you have the headboard foot bailard and you don't have the side rails. If you don't, just buy a piece of one by six um, lumber that can replace the side rails. Um, what we then did then was cut all the side rails directly in half. And then here's the tricky part or the interesting part. I got the footboard and I cut it in half as well. Now, Ada, on yours, you've got spindles, and there's a spindle in the center, so I would cut it on either side of the spindle. Um, for this particular headboard, it was a really tall headboard, and it would look like an odd bench, so I just took six inches off the bottom to lower that headboard. Now, you're gonna take your two halves of your footboard and nail or screw them to the sides of the headboard, and then take that half piece of side rail and nail it to the front. Um, and that's going to get oh, the lovely. sort of basis of your bench. That's right. really lovely. It's and, beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. Mm. And I know you have step-by-step. I got tears in my eyes. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, of course you do. Well, I think the bed, his bed, I think, it, you know, it's, it's a very similar style to this, and I think it's going to be a, a wonderful translation. So what is the next step from here? So the next step, you remember those, those rails. If you want to grab me one of the yep. rails, um, what the rails have on them usually um, is this little piece, which is where your box spring sits. So I went uh -huh. ahead and I, I took that off and... I cut it into a smaller length, and if you can see here, if we can get the camera in here, I attached it right here to the side, so that's gonna hold our planks, and Mark, if you wanna okay. pass me that air gun. Sure. And I'm using an air gun here, but any hammer, nails, or screwdriver, this is just faster okay. for us on TV. Um, so you're just, yeah. this is a cleat that you're putting in. Right. And, oh, and I cut it too long. I just want to ask a question. All right, I cut it too long, so you have to forgive me here. Is there someone who can help you put this together, Ada? Yes, I think I'm going to ask my brother. Your brother? Yeah, uh, yeah my younger brother, because he does all, a lot of woodworking. Oh, so oh perfect. perfect. And this is very simple. Now, those planks I got after taking that front rail off, they I measured, and I had to trim them just Clean a edge. slight bit. And that is going to make our our seat.